what up welcome back to another video guys we got a beautiful day out here in dirty jersey blue skies clear skies eh, no blue skies anywhere it's like a mix of sunny but cloud I, uh, I i don't know yeah it's it's nice weather though out here yes it's true no it's not clickbait i am selling the dyna um I know some of you guys are very surprised because I mean I do love this bike. Um, not even a year yet. Got this bike back in what was it? September, end of September I think. Um, so almost a year, and we've done a ton of work to it. But in all honesty, I think it's just time to turn the page. It's time to move on forward to the next chapter. And uh, I can't just keep adding bikes to the stable. Like, my wife's gonna kill me. <laughs> I got the 2020 Lowrider S. I got this bike. Just got the Sporty a little while ago. And um, yes, there's something else that I want. But in order for me to get that bike, I need to give something up. And it cannot be the Lowrider S because I would never sell that bike. That's just my favorite bike. The Sporty I just got, and me and my cousin went half on it, and we're doing a little project with it, and it's like something different. Um, so, which leaves us to this bike. <laughs> oh, it's just fun. Yeah, she's fun. You know what? Now that we're just on the way this way, I'm just gonna go pull up at Bergen Harley because I need to go pick up a O2 sensor for the Sporty. This bike is really, really fun to ride, man. And that very distinctive sound you get from that twin cam is just beautiful. Now, I'm not gonna get into this video and start talking about what bike I want. If you've been following for a long time, if you are a true follower then you might have some idea of what it is right so leave your thoughts and comments down below on what that is and if you don't know take a wild guess now another reason why I'm getting this bike is because the one that I want next is something completely different and I really don't see a point in having this bike and the 2020 Lowrider S, being that they're so similar, yes, I have made that argument plenty, plenty of times on how different these bikes are, but yeah, they are also very, very similar. So it just doesn't make any sense. You know, once we pull over here at uh, Bergen Harley, then we'll give the bike a little walk around and we'll just go over a few little things that I have done to this bike. So in case anyone is in the local Jersey, New York, even Connecticut or PA area, then you can reach out to me. Uh, easiest way to reach out to me is on my Instagram, same name as my YouTube, MarvelKid87. So you can uh, shoot me a DM on there if you are interested. I am uh, in no rush to sell it, so don't come with any uh, lowball offers. Ah. Bergen Harley Davidson. Let me clear my throat. All right, so just really quick, I just finished installing the six inch chromed out thrashes supply risers made in the US of A. Beautiful uh, risers. We got the uh, leather pros. The leather pros are. I don't know if I'm going to sell them with the bike. I might keep them, actually. Um, we got the uh, Legend Suspension on here. Amazing things. i got to make a follow-up video on that right now. We have the TBR 201. Um, we got the Booster Brad uh, Blue Pegs uh, Dino Jet Tuner um, RLMS Air Cleaner and the Memphis Shades Road Warrior. 
which I did with the plastic dip. So if you want, you can actually just peel this paint off and it's black underneath in case you want it black or in case if you want to paint it yourself. And then we got this um, Daymaker light here from Amazon. This thing is pretty amazing for the price, 30 bucks. And that's um, pretty much everything that I did to it. I had um, a ton of work that I wanted to do to it, but just doesn't make any sense to keep going with that. But yeah, um, in the back we got the uh, Custom Dynamics uh, light. And um, I forgot what this laydown play hold is from. Might be Kuryakin or something else. Shift linkage from San Jose Customs uh, with the shifter peg right here as well. Clean like a bike. How many miles does this bike have? 2,679. So basically brand new. This bike is, yeah, brand new. You guys know me, I take care of my bikes. No issues, no drops, no scratches, no dents. Just a beautiful, beautiful Dyna 2015. That's mine, yep. Where'd you get these bags? Those are from uh, Leather Pros. Oh, yeah, you got them online? Yeah, they're uh, removable. Really nice. Yeah, huh? That's yours right there? Uh -huh. I had to bring some parts here. I got my car. Okay. But uh, I got a soft tail. Nice. I bought it about a month ago. Oh man, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. Awesome. This thing's pretty loud. Yeah, it's pretty nice. I like it. <laughs> <laughs> pretty, pretty nice. Yeah. All right, man. Good luck, man. Thank you. Take it easy. All right. All right. I think that's going to pretty much be it, guys. I'm going to catch you in the next one. Like I said, if you are interested in this bike, let me know. Hit me up on Instagram. Um, I'm going to be posting up. i got to do a follow-up video on the leather suspension and a follow-up video on the leather pro. So that's coming as well. Um, so tune in for that within the next week. And there's also a lot of content coming for the 2020 Lowrider S. I got the um, FXRP fairing coming out from the shop. I got to had to get something painted on it. And uh, more work to the sporty. Let's go inside. I'm going to catch you guys in the next one, baby. Like always, let the force be with you. Ride safe and enjoy the ride, baby. Peace.